So recently, Quinny Health announced that they're doing this Lumio project and you have taken on the role of a clinical lead of Lumio. Can you Jay, just you know, tell us a little bit first about what Lumio actually is? Yeah, so, so absolutely. I think that's the, the key first thing is what is Lumio? So Lumio is a lot of things to a lot of different people is the first way to look at this. As a physician, Lumio is about um, making things more efficient in the way we take care of patients. Lumio is going to be our electronic medical record, but it's really more than that. It's, it's going to allow us to take care of patients from the ho home to their doctor's offices to the emergency departments to the hospitals and then back home again. So it's essentially a replacement for our electronic medical record, but it's going to replace lots of other things that we're doing in the hospital in order to try, and in the community I should say, in order to try to maximize our patient care and increase the efficiency of what we're doing. That's wonderful. So we're going to hear more about the details around that um, from Gino Johar in the next segment. So tell us about your role as the clinical lead. So as the cl clinical lead, I feel like I'm the representative or the link between the clinical staff, between the physician staff, the nursing staff, between the clinical staff taking care of patients and the project. Mm -hmm. um, so how are we going to apply this? How are we going to apply this technology? How are we going to apply this electronic medical record? How are we going to apply all the things that go along with it to make, making sure our patients are being taken care of in the best possible way? So. Yes, if you think about what Lumio is, for someone who works in IT, it's a computer program. For someone in administration, it might be how to get patients in and out of hospital. For myself as a physician, it's how to do my job most efficiently. And as the clinical lead, I feel that's, that's where my influence is or my opinion is or that's where my role is in this project is, is pr making sure that there's the clinical slant that's there so that we're doing things efficiently, appropriately, and to the best interest, obviously, of our patients. So you're the quarterback for all the clinicians, basically, representing Quinney Health. I'll say representative, but, <laughs> but I like the quarterback term as well. That's a nice way to call it. All right. <laughs> well, we all need a quarterback, so I'm glad you're it. I, I certainly have a lot of confidence in your ability to make this thing happen. Putting, taking the, the lead hat off and, and speaking as a nephrologist who has a patient roster of thousands, um, you obviously you know, know the system and know the limitations of the system. So how are physicians going to benefit specifically from this project of Lumio? Yeah. So, so one of the things is, is healthcare is sometimes very frustrating. We all know that. The getting information is difficult, transmitting information is difficult, continuity of care is sometimes very difficult. Mm -hmm. In our area here, we have, we have four different hospitals, but then we interact with multiple other hospitals right. in the area and in the province. And, and unfortunately, although there are resources out there for physicians to try to get information, it's, it's difficult. Um, so one of the big things that I see this project is doing is it's going to start streamlining how we communicate. It's going to hopefully put more and more of the information in one place and in an easy place to find things. And by extension, it's going to make the communication between providers, between hospitals, between sites, between everybody involved in the system more efficient and, and hopefully we'll actually be able to speak to each other better because everything right. is going to be there in the same language. You know, if you think about what happens now, it, it's very difficult. A patient may show up in one hospital, come to another, get seen by one doctor in one clinical setting and then in another setting. And, and sometimes you just don't always have that information. I'm really hoping that with this project, we're going to be able to streamline things a lot more efficiently and effectively so that as a physician, it's going to make my life hopefully easier. So will it make the patient's journey a little obviously more efficient with getting the kind of results they need whether it's lab tests or biopsies or things like that but will it also make things a little faster and reduce wait times well i hope so you know it any new project is difficult and starting a new project is difficult mm -hmm. so we have to think about things in the long game not in the short game right when we start this things are going to slow down a little bit there's no doubt we all have to learn how to do things properly that's, that's just the way things work. Right. But in the long term, my expectation is it will be because we're going to be able to see everything that's there. Patients aren't going to have to repeat their story over and over again. They're hopefully not going to have to repeat testing over and over again. And certainly the, the communication between people should be much more efficient such that I expect we should be able to start moving through the process a lot faster. Good. At least I hope so. That's the way it's supposed <laughs> to work. Well, let's hope so for sure. You